Hi guys, and welcome back to this episode of Stardew Valley. One thing I wanted to do is I wanted to make another chest because I'm going to plan this. Let's see. I'm gonna put this one somewhere where it can go, hopefully. Uh, okay. Well, that looks dumb. Can I? I'm afraid. Okay, good. I don't just absolutely destroy it. Um, I'm gonna put it right there. So my plan for that chest is going to be put things that I have to turn in to the bundles. So that, and I think that's it for right now. So, nope, don't do that. So I'm thinking if I just keep them in here, then I definitely won't be super dumb and forget to, like, take my stuff to the bundles and be super dumb. Hi, kitty. Because, especially with the whole spring crop thing, I only have a limited amount of time to get that there and going. So that's not going to happen. I am definitely not going to lose that time. I can I can forgive myself on the earth crystal thing. That was just dumb. My bad. Wasn't really thinking about it, but no. The crops are like top priority, if at all possible. Hi, Bunny. All right, well... We are, actually, we are almost done with our next little quest thing. Excuse me, thank you. We have nine more floors. Ooh, it is getting spooky down here and everything is covered in rocks. Do I have anything to make torches? No, wait, do I? No, I'm dumb. I was reading that incorrectly. What the hell, what? 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 I have no idea what I just hit. Oh. Are those skeletons? Oh, and those are bats. Okay, um... Everything is now slightly a little more worrisome. There are a lot of bats. Lots and lots of bats. But I am getting lots of bat wings. Which I also need for a bundle. So, okay. Anyways, um... For right now, we are going to run the hell away because I was not aware that there would be so many things trying to kill me and that I wasn't smart enough to make torches. So we're going to go back and make some torches and we're definitely going to put the bat wings away because now I can understand where that whole bat wing thing came from. I had only found slime out of all the monster loot they were giving me. So I was wondering when I was going to run into bats. I was just not hoping it would be in pitch black darkness uh, with like nine of them and apparently what looked a lot like skeletons. Okay, sap and wood. Thank goodness we have a ton of that. And I'm going to make all the torches I can. I think for the time being, because mining is currently my top priority. Put those back. I'm gonna throw the bat. No, nope, don't, don't block. Don't try to be cool. Put the bat wings in there, so I don't forget to get, forget about them and sell them like an idiot. Okay, yeah. Let's. I was worried about how in-game late it was, but I might as well take care of, or at least utilize the essentially eight in-game hours that I have, because why not? It's just more extra work I can get things done with. Hi, Bonnie. I, part of me thinks that there might be something significant with the wild animals running around, but I don't know. I could be totally wrong. They could just be super useless. Excuse me. Am I just dumb? Can you, can you let me on the thing? The elevator, please? Maybe? Okay. It seems to be without the sword or whatever. 
that I can... Look! Now that I go and make torches, they spawned a bunch of torches down here. Like, oh, we see you worked really hard to make this place explorable. Well, we're just gonna help you out a little. Well, screw you, game. Not a big fan of you at the moment. Oh, I really don't like that noise, even though I'm pretty sure I know what it is. I don't like the unknown. Why can't we just be in... Okay. Uh, what the hell is that? First of all. These are like... They look like... Golems? Almost? Smack em. Smack em. That's a terrifying, terrible noise that they make. And they seem to take forever to die. Although, the, the interval in which bats are appearing, they make me think they're vampires or something. Every time I go and smack one, a bat appears. Those stupid things are controlling the bats. Excuse me, I need to kill you. Yeah, okay, so they're golems. Because I'm getting stone from killing them. So, anyways. And that looks like it's a fairly small floor. So that looks like that's the end of that. Well, that wasn't actually too bad once I found out what I was up against. The amount of hits those things take to die, it's just a, just a teensy bit obnoxious. Just a little, little tiny bit. And, and the noises they make. You need to die. Thank you. But other than that, they're not too bad. Oh, there we go. I was wondering, I was gonna say, where the hell is the exit to this place? Golem, you and I will not be friends. The one thing I'm really hoping I don't ever find in these mines is spiders. Because if there's one thing I cannot stand in this world, it is spiders. I'm absolutely terrified of them. I would actually listen to this that noise on repeat for like nine years rather than have spiders crawl over all over me for an extended amount of time. I couldn't come up with whoa. Also those guys blending into the background kind of scares me a little. He just started moving and showed up. He was invisible to me up until that point. Listen buddy, you gotta die. Gotta die. Nope. God damn it. You too. Why are you guys even here? You wanna blend in with the rocks? Having fun with your rock friends? I don't need you. I don't need you in my life. You're being real, real obnoxious. And I don't want you here. My general strategy to get through these stupid floors is to just keep moving in farther towards where I assume the end of the floor is and usually the stairs are closer to that than anything else. Nope. I'm not messing with you, Golem. There. I somehow managed to find the stairs in almost pitch darkness. Really? Really with the Golems? They're all freaking over. I'm not dealing with this. I just realized I left a geode back there, but... Oh well, I've already moved on in the mine, so god damn it. We're gonna get past these stupid golems. Probably get to something even more terrifying, but... You know, at least get past the golems. So I don't have to deal with their obnoxious noises. I'm actually going to try to leave them alone in any instance I can, because they're not fun to deal with. I'm also going to try to minimize my use of torches, seeing as I only have nine left, and I'd like to get through six more floors, if at all possible, within this run of the mine, because I am actually running out of uh, night, night light. I might be 
playing the when am I gonna pass out game. Okay, there we go. Done. Awesome. That's what I was looking for. One more floor. We are so freaking close to level 40. Just five more of probably golem infested hell. And bats. Even the bats aren't the worst part of that. The golem and their noises and their 500 health. Also, I realized that I was not keeping an eye out for the little worm guys. I need to do that while I'm just kind of casually walking because I guess those things are really important. And it really wouldn't hurt that much to look out for them. Okay, so I have a little bit more bat wings. I have so many geodes. Holy crap. I was looking, I have four. Okay, it's not actually a lot. What the hell is that? An ancient seed. Okay. In fact, even the artifacts and things I might keep in that other chest, just so I remember where the hell they are. Now I'm gonna go to sleep. There's like 10 minutes before it tells me to go the hell to sleep, so I thought I'd indulge it and be nice. Oh. Oh. Uh, well, yeah. That I did not know was going to happen. So, that's a real bummer, actually. That means my spring crops will not get finished. Um, damn it. Okay. Well, anyways, I think put all this stuff away. Not that. I need to remember not to put that in there. Put that in there. Actually, you know, since we'll be over in that area already, I think I am going to... Never mind. I'm dumb. I keep wanting to try to upgrade my tools. But I don't have any money for that. Because if I had a couple more rounds of selling things, I might have money for it. God damn it. No? Still nothing. Okay. I don't think I understand how that thing works completely, but I'll figure it out. Okay. Geodes are going in there. Artifacts are going in there. I am going to stick... Hi, kitty. Hi, kitty. I'm going to stick with what I was working on and try to get to level 40 and then maybe work on foraging if I have any extra time because it's now... Yep. Guarantee you those are foraging. I never looked at the summer foraging, but those are probably part of it. Whatever this is. Maybe that's part of it, too. In fact, while I'm thinking of it, those are gonna go hide down there so I don't start eating up for energy and realize what I've done later on, after it's too freaking late. <sighs> okay... The atmosphere changes so much in just one season. All the trees look different. Looks like a, another continent that we're on. But all it's done is changed a season. Whoa. That was pretty lucky. I'm not gonna pass up gifts like that. Whoa. What the hell? Okay. There's just a little sleeping golem. He was just tired. Laying down for a nice nap, and I woke him up, and then pissed him off, and decided I wasn't going to deal with him. Okay, it's going to get pitch black, so I might as well put down at least some of these. Any ones of them I can spare. Oh no. Oh no, come on, bats. Bring it on. Bring it on. That was actually kind of spooky. The fog rolled in, and then I was attacked by bats. I hear more of them. You are not a bat. Don't run away from me. If you're gonna initiate a fight with me, you're gonna finish. We're gonna finish this fight. Well, okay. I'm moderately annoyed, but actually kind of happy that all these bats are attacking me, because then I'm gonna get bat wings. Oh god, so many bat wings. But can you stop? Can you stop? Can you please stop? 
Can you stop with your infinite spawning, please? Oh my. Oh my. Come back here. Come back. Come back and die. Come back and die. Why is this happening? Why? Why did this have to happen? I really hope this isn't a constant thing. Okay. Okay. The fog went away. Regardless of the fact that I'm hearing constant footsteps, at least I'm not getting infinitely swarmed by bats now. It makes matters a little more terrifying. Okay, let's... Okay, screw you. I'm not going to be on that floor for any longer. Uh, so I should hopefully, you know, definitely have enough bat wings at this point. Seeing as I just fought an entire armada of them. Okay. Trying to find the exit. Cause god damn it. I'm tired of dealing with these floors. Not doing this. I'm... Um, nothing interesting. Okay, fuck it. We're going down. Hoping to find... Oh, here's a topaz. Hoping to find better minerals and everything in the farther levels of the mine. It's a minecart track I should actually... Earth crystal. should follow this to see if there's a cart full of coal. Because I learned that recently. Uh, Alright. I'm not immediately finding the exit. But it's okay. I have plenty of things for energy. Absolutely a ton. It was quite an investment in terms of money. Okay, where's that little bat coming from? I'm ready for you. Thought I saw him over there. Oh, I did. You bastard. Don't hide in the wall. Come here. If I'm gonna at least kill you, I need to take your loot. Thank you. Okay, I assume that lone rock over there was going to be the exit. I don't like these bats. I guess I like the fact that I can hear them coming rather than just be surprised by them, but they're not exactly the funnest thing to deal with. Although, after that killing spree of that floor of bats, if I have anything at the Adventurer's Guild to do with them, I've probably completed it by now. Ha! It was in one of the corners. I knew it. it was... Okay, well, I was hoping that would be the case. And I hoped correctly. Okay, I just want to get out of here. I'm at level 40, thank god. I got a slingshot! What the hell does a slingshot do? Requires stones for ammo. Like those? Those kind of stones? No? Okay, not those kind of stones. That is so cool! I have a ranged weapon now. Okay, well, let's see. I'm going to go back up. And... Huh. Okay. I think, right now, I am probably... Probably going to end this episode here. We're we're close enough, and I am probably going to see about turning in those geodes to the blacksmith, I think is the next thing we're going to do, because we desperately need to start seeing if there's anything cool in those. So hopefully if I have enough time in this day today, whenever the blacksmith closes, hopefully I can beat him there. Um, we'll do that and see what kind of cool stuff we get. So I will see you all in the next episode. Actually, first... Oh, okay, the bottom of the mine. Okay, we'll see you then, everyone. Bye-bye.